Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jeff. So in this video, we're gonna check out Irene and Selgi Naughty. So I know this is a music video, I think, but you guys came for me on my social medias and were like, you gotta see this. I'm like, okay. And then it kind of like, from what you guys have showed me, it seems like the choreography is, is well shot anyway. Like you can actually see the choreography. So we're gonna do this. It's a four and a half minute song. We like to see it. Oh, damn. Oh, gorgeous. <laughs> they look so elegant. Wait, I need... This is such an epic intro. Queen of the Galaxy. Such contrast. Oh my god, this is gonna be so good. I can already tell. Nice isolation with the arms. It's voguing, right? Ooh. Okay, this part is more tutting. Okay, tutting is very difficult, okay? And it's not because of the moves. It's because of the isolation and the, the sequence. That's what's difficult. Because it's easy to be like, okay, the choreo, the, the, the move is like this, for example. But it's what comes after. And then because it's so fast too, that's what makes it, makes it difficult. Um, you gotta be like really paying attention and you gotta or like depending on how you memorize are you, uh, you Do you mem memorize by like repetition or do you can you just like look at it and like you got it? Those are geniuses um, but if you're a person who Learns by repetition imagine the amount of time you have to do these sequences to get it right and like the timing as well as the sequence And the shapes too, the shapes that they're doing. Nice. Ooh. Beautiful. They're mixing. Sorry, I know it's the. <laughs> ah, you guys know I have a degree in pausing, okay? Uh, because I want to dissect the dissect, uh, the section before we go on to the next one. Anyway, so I'm losing my thought. Um, there's a lot of um, variation in there with uh, dynamics and levels. So with that, they're going fast as well as slow. They're mixing a lot of that. Hold on, let me just... Because I forgot what I was going to say. See, they're also including their, their foot like that. Oh, coordination. Hello. Interesting. Nice. There's a million variations that they're doing with this tutting thing. Tutting and voguing. I feel like it's a mix of both. Um, because tutting, from what I know anyway, I'm not well versed in it. It's like more on the fingers and kind of like here. It doesn't reach out this much and i feel like when it's up here now i feel like it's more like voguing instead of um instead of tutting but i feel like it's a good mixture and blend <laughs> ah, this fucking detail seriously like even like this part oh the sequence though, that's what's, there's a million different ways. That part? <laughs> How the hell did she get there? It, remind, it reminds me of like, you know when you're trying to do this? This thing? Like that kind of feeling. 
I love this cinematography. Holy shit. Mm, also, let's talk about the vocals. Damn. Beautiful. So with that, what she, um, oh my god, I forgot, Irene. I, Irene is the one in the white, right? Um, whew. You guys are probably like cringing if it's wrong. This part, the leg part, that part when uh, not everybody's coordinated enough to do that, um, it's a lot, it's really it's like isolation. And because we don't isolate our legs like that all the time, um, it's it's easy by itself but when you add like those intricate movements up top when you're cl clicking like that there the shape of it it's what's gonna be difficult because some i feel like most people would do that but it's the, the angle would be a little bit slanted or like it's gonna be a little bit off unless you have very good coordination senses and isolating um capabilities <laughs> Oh my god, I'm sure you guys are all trying to learn this right now. Whoa. Oh, what the hell? It's, there's so much to process. Good luck learning these. There's so much sequence. So many sequences. My English is wrong. Got colors now. Wow. So I'm I'm seeing a different style between them, um, which is not bad at all. So um, the girl in the white, I'm gonna think it's Irene. Um, her movements are quite. It's quite. Um, straight <laughs> that's what i'm gonna just say straight <laughs> uh it's not in a bad way or anything um it's, it's straight and in that case it when she's isolating um and tutting and, and voguing whatever it's very clean like the lines are very clean yet for soggy she has a little bit of um kind of uh bend to the way she's moving here even just with like um it's just because here she has a, little more, has a little bit more bounds. Like even when she went like this. And like the way she did that. So, so it seems like Irene, oh my god, this is gonna be so bad if her name is not Irene. The girl in the white um, is, it seems like she has more ballet training because her upright position is quite tall um and Solgi's girl in the black <laughs> um has a little bit more uh kind of waves to the way she's moving it's a very good song too <laughs> yes, queens. Love the outfits too. 
I wish the CGI was better in this though. <laughs> I think they're going more for like anime, no, not anime, more like RPG. I think that's what it was when you guys said for Monster. I think they're following that concept. Interesting, there's definitely a third music video cause that doesn't look finished. That looks like there's something's gonna come out. <laughs> So with, with Tutting, the way they did it, um, it's more, if you guys can't really comprehend the complicatedness of it, the complexity of it, look at it for from a riffing perspective. When singers do riffings and um, licks in their songs, when they bend uh, movements, stuff like that, that intricacy and that complicatedness, complexity, that's how hard it is because you got to be creative enough to think of those movements and to execute those movements in a timely manner. The, 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 the sequence, like I've said all throughout that whole choreography. Okay, this is very unexpected and I'm very pleased. <laughs> Well, thank you guys for watching today. I hope that you enjoyed it. And if you did, do like and subscribe. And if you do subscribe, make sure you tick that notification bell so you don't miss any content from me. And if you'd like to get to know more about me, do check out my Instagram and Twitter down below.